You know, when you drive through this neighborhood, you can't help but notice this home for several reasons. One, there's no lawn. Two, it has beautiful shade trees. Three, it is so manicured. And four, it is so well landscaped by the homeowner himself. He took advantage of the shade. Since grass wouldn't grow, he decided to go ahead and use natural rock that he brought in and perhaps got from his backyard since he lives on a slope and created retaining walls, raised areas that he burned with soil so there's a good foundation. And then he planted it full of beautiful plants, but not too full so you have space in between. For example, here we have a beautiful Gumpo Azalea, which is blooming later than normal because they're a later variety of Azalea. Then instead of having lawn, he did dwarf Mondo grass, which before you know it, it's going to grow together and look like a solid carpet of ground cover. Then he, he went ahead and planted this purple Exalus, which I love, next to this lime sweet fly grass. Say hello, you notice it from far away, and then different shrubs and foundation plantings to give his front yard a totally different look. When you do this, you do it for yourself, but your neighbors, your family, and your friends will enjoy it as well. So dare to be different. Do something different to your front yard. Start now, and you too can have a park-like setting at your own home. You're watching today's home. I'm Chris H. Olson.